Remember me? I thought you were going to take your business elsewhere. Well, lucky for you, I believe in second chances. <clears throat> now, I know that you don't have girl baseball trophies in stock, but could you have one made special? Sure. Great. A custom mold is 50 bucks, and it takes six weeks. I'm not paying you $50 for a trophy, and I don't have six weeks. Well, does your daughter look like a horse? Maybe she'd like this. And you won't let God talk was covering something really evil. I am trying to make a special trophy for Missy. So I'm gonna take this head and put it on that body. Whatever you say, Dr. Frankenstein. My daughter deserves to have a trophy that looks something like her. So this is kind of a feminist gesture on your part. I prefer to think of it as a maternal gesture. Let's just split the difference and call it the stuff of nightmares. It'll look better when I paint it. I don't think so. Hey, I have something to show you. What's up? I was gonna give this to you at the end of the season party, but I was so excited that I wanted you to see it now. What the hell is that? I couldn't find any girl baseball trophy, so I made you one. Why is her head so big? It's a Barbie head. I had to improvise. You chopped the head off one of my Barbies? Don't be silly. I bought a new one. I could have had a new Barbie. The point is, you deserve to be recognized appropriately for everything you've accomplished. You can't give that to me in front of all the boys. Why? It's embarrassing. Well, we have plenty of time. I can make the head smaller or the body bigger or a little bit more. I just want the same trophy everyone else gets. But I want you to feel special. And I just want to feel regular. Okay. Well, I'll make sure you get a regular one at the party. Thank you. Mom, wait. I get what you were trying to do. It's nice. Thanks. Can I keep that one too? You really want it? I do. Despite her many flaws, my sister did have a soft spot in her heart. And a fondness for blowing things up.